here. <laughs> of all places, you chose here. This can't be happening. You could have picked Venice, or Paris, even Mount Everest, for goodness sakes. But you chose Mr. Porker's. Dad. Oh, gee, what kind of food did you order? Wait, wait, is it a medium rare porterhouse? Smothered bacon, mushrooms, with a side of green beans? No. It's a half charred, previously frozen slab of pork feces. Dad, come on. I'm not getting any deader, son. The least you could have done is given me a decent meal. That'll do, pig. That'll do. I can't believe that even here you're like this. Well, what do you expect? Not like I could have changed. No, this isn't real. This isn't happening. I'm just trying to cope with, um... Did you just... Psst. Ooh, keep it up. I'll do it again. But how... You're not. Stop that. Told you. This is just a bad dream. I just need to. Just need to wake up. Mm, let me help with that. Hey, no. Wake up. No, it's not half bad. Wake up. I would have preferred some caviar and wine, but it's not bad. Wake up! Look, you need some help. Stop. No. Stop. This isn't real. This isn't real. This isn't happening. You're not here. I'm not here because you're dead. And I just need to move on. But I, I can't move on like this. And I. Is this what a psychotic break feels like? Because you're not real. You're not here, you're dead. Have you ever thought that maybe there's another reason we're both here? Like what? Matt, it's time you faced some cold, hard reality. Oh, what reality? The reality that, that you left? That you left me and mom? Because I got news for you, buddy. I already faced that reality and I really don't feel like facing it again. All right, look, this is not about me. No, it's always been about you. From day one, it's been about you. I'm gonna start pointing fingers. Let's point fingers. When has this not been about you? What about when you left us? Do you wanna talk about that? Oh, I can't do this now. You never cared about what your mother and I thought. You just left. I did what I had to. Right, for your family. Why do you think I did? No, everything what? that you did, everything you did was for you. No! Everything I did was for you. No, you're not real! You're not here! You're dead! Yes. I am. And you need to face that. So enlighten me. How exactly was you leaving in the middle of the night, walking out on your family for 15 years helpful? How was that for us? Not both of you. Just you. How? It must have been tough, being without a father for so long. Yeah, I got used to it. You probably remember your mother and I fighting almost every day. How could I not? That was no way for you to grow up. All right, your mother is, is a nice person. And I knew you'd be safe. Uh, you'd never have a good life if I stuck around. So you left for 15 years. Again, Matt. Yeah, it's not about me. What's done is done. My regrets, sir. No, they're mine alone. But you, 
With your regrets, you'll never leave here. What do you mean I'll never leave here? What, am I locked in here? There's only one way out. Oh, what? By accepting your death? I don't care. You left. You left me and you left mom and we survived without you. We don't need you. So why should I care? Because you're here. You put yourself here, because remember? Because of you. Snap out of it, man! What do you want from me? Do you want a hug? Huh? You want me to say sorry because you left? You want me to say sorry because mom cried every day for you for a year? You want me to say sorry because I couldn't move on even when she could? I didn't want her to remarry. I wanted you to come home. You want me to say sorry for that? You want me to say sorry because I needed my dad and I waited for you to come home? You want me to say sorry because I waited up for you to come through the door and tell me that you loved me again? And that you wanted me, you, and you, you want me to say sorry? for you. I left because I wanted you to be better than me. I hated who I was. I just wanted you to be so much better. 